ironically, ironically, that um, mission would have been easier if I stacked towers. <laughs> if I just result to my age-old plan of just stack towers. I really need to upgrade your shit, man, clearly. Oh, father, yeah, we are, we are a bit behind. The good thing about that grinding that I was doing, it got me mad money. It was getting me mad money. I have XP potions. Okay. I could sell all these, but I'm stocking them for the item world. But I don't think I'll ever actually need it. Because unlike uh, this guy too, I don't know how much I'm going to attempt to delve into the post game. Honestly, because after... After... Spending days trying to get all the pirates and treasure maps and just seeing how that was leading nowhere. I, I decided against it, so I don't know if I'm actually going to go ahead and do that or not, quite frankly. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I need to get you a lot more mana. Mm, as well. I probably won't get Giga. I probably won't get Giga because of the uh, mana costs, honestly. And because I'm addicted to the reincarnating up in the stats and all that. Weirdly, this I don't know what it is, but this series specifically brings out the grind in me. But only when I'm achieving something. As I said with the treasure maps, I spent days and got rid of nowhere because it's a random chance. So it's like, I gotta, I gotta keep delving down these item worlds levels to like level 40 something, 50 something and there's a chance it will spawn and I was getting nowhere so it's just like I don't fucking know <laughs> no I'm not doing that well stuff of this was like I'm gonna just grind some levels get some mana upgrade my stuff reincarnate do it again do the loop again I'm fine with that so I'll probably just never get Giga unless I take like a post game I might not again though we'll see I might just get to the uh I might just get to um, the credits and then start up what is obviously the, the uh, what's, what would be called, Raspel mode probably, <laughs> the Etna mode of this game, and then I'll be done. Honestly, I don't know if I'm gonna, well that depends, what is the, what would be the end game here, I don't know, or the post game, because they had the Dark Worlds in, uh, they had the Dark Worlds in Land of Carnage in the last game, so I, that depends, I don't know, we'll see how I feel, <laughs> literally just we'll see how I feel. Got Mega Wind and Mega Ice. And you just got Mega Wind. I didn't get Mega Fire for you. I should have, but I didn't. Alright, well. You'll probably get Mega Fire. And then you'll also get Mega Ice. Alright. And that one stage, you got a lot of mana, Jesus. <laughs> Alright, yeah. As we go on as well, that's the thing. Mana just gets easier and easier to get. Oh god, what is this? No effect, no effect, no effect, no effect. Um... Okay. I... Now there's effects. God damn it! Attack, defense, mana fifth. Oh, what was the what was the mana? Also, why would I do why no effect if there's effects? No, I get, I get. It's just it's strange. It's strange how it works for me. All right, so we'll just get the mana up, I guess. In in fact, then if that's the case. 
If we can just get more mana here. Excuse me. While I just get some mana real quick. I'll go ahead and just get some mana. Do not mind me. Give me mana boosts, I'm gonna I'm gonna make use of the mana boosts. It's that simple. <laughs> in any in any respect, if you give me a, a sort of mana boost, I'm getting mana boosts. I am using. I'm juicing. Oh, I, I should take off. I should take off the uh effects for that. I'll be real. All right. Ah, and because I heal, I can't get killed. I'm cool with this. Well, I can. It would take a lot. Is this stage literally just here to farm up some mana? Is that literally just why this stage is here? To farm up some mana? Because, like, I'm cool with that. Because, like, they're level 33, so that'd be 33 mana per kill, plus 50%. Although, I don't know how, um... I, like, I don't know how XP and mana splits between, uh, tower attacks. I assume it's it's divided like equally between everyone who's in the tower. So it'll be 33 mana plus 50% divided by one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, seven, ten. Okay. Yeah, so it'll be 33, 33 uh, times or plus, however, however it calculates, plus or times, 50%, divided by 10. That's still not bad, honestly, that's still alright. Well, I say that, it would be like, what? Let's, let's say it's plus 15%, so that'll be... 15%, 50%, so that'll be... It's about 60... and a half. So... 6 and a half onto 33 would be 49 and a half. So let's round it up to 50. 50 divided by 10, 5. 5 mana per kill for each person. Eh, not a lot, not bad. Right, people are leveling, so <laughs> the XP is good at least.
Yeah, that's what, like 10 enemies, so 5 enemies, at, well, 10 enemies at 5 mana kill, that's 50 mana per person right there. I'm fine with that, quite frankly. I don't know if the maps checks out exactly, and I didn't take a look at uh, mana beforehand, so I could now verify, but... Yeah, I didn't take a look at mana beforehand to verify. I'd never use your mana for anything, I may as well. Learn your stuff, you need a lot of cheese. Okay, you know what? <laughs> you know what? I think, yeah, I think boosting might be better than learning skills because the amount of the amount of uh, mana required just to learn this, I can level up something else like five, six times. More than that, even. Jesus. Okay. Yeah, you know what? Apart from apart from the mages. Apart from the mages learning the new elements, so even then I only really need one mage to learn all the elements, but I'm, I'm being weird like this, I need two for some reason. <laughs> but other than that, like yeah, just boosting is just factually correct. <laughs> boosting is just factually the better option. Alright. Greetings are the building blocks of manners. Can't do it? Then kill them! Don't worry! We'll clean up the corpses! Please help us by recycling! Damn it! We're hit! Medic! We got dragged into the dreadful volunteer activities of the seniors! Who cares about contributing to society? We don't care to respect our elders! I'll never give up my seat for them! Mood. I find that to donate is to die! We'll make them join a charity tribe! Charge into the main sophomore forces! A blood donation purge against honor students! Put your right hand over your heart and charge! The time has come to counterattack. The target is the main senior forces. The loud greetings and sports squads. Listen, do not forget I am with you. Believe in me. Trust the evil fiend next to you. Take back your freedom! Yeah! Fools! Easily led into our trap! Seems this is gonna be Master Big Star's grave! We just need to get rid of Master Big Star! Then no one can prevent us from our goal to defeat the Overlord! Looks pretty crazy out there. So we're not gonna get involved, right? We're gonna let them take each other out, right? stuff about my potential and whatnot. Then <laughs> look what good he can do. There you are, Overlord Son. Seems you've managed to clean up the remnants. Somewhat useful, I see. Even now, you act tough. The way I see it, you're going to lose this war. But if you tell me where the senior classrooms are, maybe we'll back you up. <laughs> now, what will it be? Seriously, how inelegant can you be? Your help is but a piece of glass that was dropped on a moonless night. I've mentioned before that this is my favourite voice actor in the entire industry, right? <laughs> I have mentioned this before, right? Because I feel like I have. I feel like every game he shows up in, I mention it. I'm not so foolish as to pick up something so fragile without a plan. What? You're okay with losing like this? Even if the chance of winning is zero percent, it's a leader's role to make it a hundred percent. I doubt you would understand that. Guys, stop battling with your egos. You're both class leaders. If you can cooperate, we can get through this. Yesterday's enemies are today's friends. A true friendship sprouts on the field of battle. Oh Friends, yeah, by the way. I believe so. By the way, in case you didn't realize, I know you're fighting delinquents, but we have delinquent with us. 
who we kind of we kind of just let hang out. <laughs> like I know she's technically your enemy, and they're getting the thing you stand for in life, but just it's fine. There's no need for such an eerie thing to sprout anywhere. I do things alone. Two tastes may seem repelling at first sight. However, an unexpected combo can bring out the best taste at times. If you both have time to argue over excuses, try tasting it first. You guys are over here as well? Oh, there's another goddamn spawner. Alright. You fuckers. You absolute bitches. Where is it? 10% chance, okay. You have to be fucked. You have to be fucked <laughs> hand to hand. Okay. From the front, did that say? Yeah, from the front, okay. But you bitches. You bitches need to be fucked in hand to hand combat. Fine. He has fucking sparkles and a rose. This son of a bitch. Alright. It counts for that as well. It's just all attacks from the front. It's just all attacks from the front. Okay. Understandable, I guess. That was just a regular ass miss. That was just a regular ass miss. Okay, well. I see you out here to hurt me. I see you out here to hurt me as a person. Understandable, I guess. And that's a 50%, but still, 50% is still, you know, not zero. A hit got off, but not on the one I wanted. What do you have? What gank can father's fit? Okay, yeah, you actually just have straight up a, a statistical upgrade to what he has. Alright, that explains. That explains that. Thank you. 
I'll be real, I didn't realise that she had heals. I might not actually ever use my healer. <laughs> I might not actually ever like properly use my healer now because I have I have an attack healer. <laughs> I have I have a, a DPS who's also a support. So my use of my healer might drastically go down now. to deal with goddamn percentage chance bullshit so we're just gonna Oh yeah, I forgot. <laughs> I forgot that was a factor. Right now we're just gonna, we're gonna just yeah. Oh, are you serious? Okay. Add one off, all right. That's a shame. You can try. Really? You gonna you gonna be like that? You really gonna be like that? All right. You really gonna do nothing but cause problems, are you? You had no right to do that. You had no right to survive that. At least your battle skills are commendable, Overlord Sun. It's early to be surprised. I've only used 1% of my maximum powers. Uh-huh. Then be more serious. 
Master Big Star, Squad 4 has reported in. They're close to being obliterated. The enemy force is double our own. Is this true? So this was the decoy. All right. All forces, head to the fields! Yes, sir. I'm sure you heard that. I have no time to deal with you now. My friends are waiting for my help. Friends? I don't understand. Servants are just sacrificial pawns. Empathy will cloud judgment. You may never understand. Good friends are treasures that cannot be replaced. Friends! Even the sophomore class leader rants about them. Master Big Star is right. Not even demons can be all alone. Joining powers with friends is what makes... Please, wait, young master. Jeffrey, what are you doing here? I bring good news. I've found out who the mastermind is. Oh? Who is it? The senior executives. The Diaz gentlemen. The Diaz gentlemen? Diaz? I, think he's, I don't even know what... Is that Spanish? But they're legends of legends. The ultimate legend. So legendary, they actually count as a lie. How's that work? That's right. Tell us it's a lie. If the DS gentlemen truly exist, the Netherworld would be gone by now. You girls look pale. I want to see them. They're students and gentlemen? Sounds too good to be true. It's not just their name that's amazing. As for their specialty dish, I hear they can even rival the Overlord. You should all be careful when tasting. No thanks. I'm already full. Jeffrey, are you sure about this? Oh, do you doubt me? If so, please, look for yourself. I've connected the gates already. <laughs> you don't need to tell me. I don't trust anyone after all. Mal, why are you saying that again? Huh. Should I force him to open his heart with a chainsaw? Jeffrey, if I beat up these DS gentlemen guys, it'll stop this defeat the overlord goal, right? Yes, that is indeed correct. Mel, are you serious about going? Of course! It's just annoying and too much work to ask the sophomores. I'll go directly to the DS gentlemen. What's wrong, Daryl? Scared? <laughs> are you kidding me? To think I can fight the legendary DS gentlemen! I'm way too happy! Uh-huh.